What's up logical people, this is Amar. In this video, we are going to solve a very gorgeous Amazon interview puzzle based on probability. A coin of diameter 1 is thrown onto an infinitely large chessboard with squares of side 2. What is the chance of the coin enclosing two colors? So you have to calculate the probability of the coin enclosing both black and white colors when it's landed on the board. The difficulty level set by the composer of this puzzle is just 2 out of 5. So you must give it a try, pause the video and think logically. The coin would enclose both black and white colors if it lands in a position that it crosses one or two sides of a square as shown here. And the coin would enclose just one color if it doesn't cross any of the sides as shown below. If the coin touches a side but does not cross it, then also the coin would enclose just one color. So, just touching one side or two sides is the maximum limit for a coin to enclose just one color. As shown here, this is the center of the coin. The position of the coin is decided by the location of the center of the coin. So, the center of the coin decides if the coin crosses a side or not. And eventually, the center of the coin would decide if the coin can enclose one color or both. So, in this position, where the coin just touches the side but doesn't cross it, if we traverse the coin along all four sides, and mark the path traversed by the center of the coin. We will get the boundary limit for the coin's center in the form of a smaller inner square, which represents the maximum limit for the center of the coin within which the coin encloses just one color. Let's highlight the area beyond this limit with a shaded region. If the center of the coin lands anywhere in the inner square, then the coin would enclose just one color of the chessboard. And if the center of the coin lands in the shaded area, then the coin would cross one or more sides and as a result, it will enclose both colors of the chessboard, black and white. Our task is to find out the chance of the coin enclosing two colors. And that means we have to calculate the probability that the center of the coin lands in the shaded area. And the shaded area is equal to the area of the main square minus the area of the inner square. Now, first let's calculate the area of the inner square. The side length of the inner square is 2 minus radius of the coin. That's 1 half. As we know, the diameter is 1. Minus 1 half again. And that's equal to 1. So its area is equal to 1. The area of the main square is 4. So the shaded area is 4 minus 1. That's equal to 3. And the probability that the center of the coin lands in the shaded area is shaded area divided by total area of the main square. And that's equal to 3 by 4. So the chances of the coin enclosing two colors is 75%. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and share the video. And if you're new, please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated with a new logic every week. Till then, give a try to these easy yet tricky interview riddles. Also check out very hard puzzles on my channel Logically Yours.